Welcome back, Marlene here with some more Ellie Noir, about to start our very first day on Vice. All finished with Homicide, we had a good time with it. The ending was infuriating, but in the best way possible. Honestly, I quite liked the climax of that one. So there were a couple things I noticed while editing the last part that the werewolf was saying some interesting things to call when we chase him through the catacombs, like asking if he is acquainted with slaughter, if he's looking for redemption. He doesn't know Cole was in the military, but that Cole presumably took a lot of lives during the war. It did get me curious though, is it foreshadowing something? Did Cole do some things he's not proud of? Is he looking for redemption? Is that why he joined the police force? I don't know. Maybe he did something very regrettable, we'll find out later. Or maybe it means nothing. It doesn't even matter. Let's just get into our first day on Vice. I want to meet our new partner. The Black Caesar. Police station. I wonder if we're gonna get to deal with some sort of mob boss Folks, or something. Welcome to Hi! Vice. Thank this you. This is your new partner, Roy Earl. Take a oh, seat. Hello there. A special request was made to transfer you to add vice. <laughs> Close smile, man. We need a man with your kind of starch on this desk, son. Thank you. We have Thank two you. dead Negroes found in an apartment this morning on Yucca Street. Ooh. Number 6358, apartment 5. We got better things to be doing than wasting our time on two dead junkies. <laughs> Did I ask your opinion, detective? Ooh. Two men dead on U.S. Army issue morphine. <gasps> that makes it an advice case. Oh, like the stories in the paper. Read it. All right, yes, all right. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> oh, hey, this guy's yeah, gotta be mad at the beginning. He rubs shoulders with the you superstars. You could say that. We used to be partners. Oh. <laughs> so you're well. working with the big boys now, Cole? I guess so, Roy. I thought homicide was the primo assignment. That may be the case. That's what I would have thought too. I asked for you personally, Phelps. I had to pull a few Aww. strings to get you over to advice. How does it feel? <laughs> eh. The lieutenant seems to think I'm doing okay. You are, buddy. Okay. <laughs> Don't get humble on me, Phelps. You're doing great. You're the department pinup boy, war hero and crime fighter. What a combination. Thank you. I can assure you I'm no war hero detective. Interesting. What happened heads. in the war there, Cole? Yeah, let's go. You know, I didn't care for this guy the first couple times we saw him. Because if I recall, we also rubbed shoulders with him a little bit. Uh, we're solving. Nice car, Roy. Oh. Is it department issue? No. Why is he letting me drive it? Is he crazy? <laughs> you can't be seen slumming it in a Nash if you're in Vice, Cole. Meanwhile, That's fair. we got needle freaks kissing a goodbye all over Central Avenue. But yeah, I remember I didn't really care too much for him and his uh, buddy back when we were trying to solve that case of the attempted murder on the movie star and her niece. I am forgetting the name of that case right now, but yeah. He told us basically to butt out when we were getting pretty close to uncovering some pretty nasty shit happening in Hollywood. Didn't care for that. Almost passed it. Oh, okay. <laughs> Junkies apartments. <laughs> 402 AM. It's like a freaking motel. And not a very nice one. They really picked a prize shithole for our first date. I see that. <laughs> it's okay though. About five it's more about the company place. than the setting. Let me through. I just want a quick look. Is all. I want to see. Okay, get out of here. Nothing to see. This is a secure area. You all need to leave. Oh, I like. It's up the stairs, detectives. <laughs> like that they put Around on a sunstrip corner, outfit. I guess I'll keep it left. on. Right, thanks, man. Is he the cop or one of Oh yeah, let's talk to him. Brothers are Can you go here? door to door? See how many of the neighbors are home. First thing we did once the apartment was secure. Word is the Vicks kept to themselves. Only time anyone ever saw them was when they went to the joint across the road for some soul food. All right, gotcha. I'm all done. You're sure okay. now. Thank you. Thank you. I already forgot which one. I think last one on the right. Be something big, right? Uh, yeah, probably this one with the door wide open. Uh, hey, Carruthers. Carruthers. Phelps? I've been reassigned to advice. Mm -hmm. What have we got? Two stiffs, overdosed, been dead a couple of days. Government issue morphine. We use the same cigarettes in Okinawa. Fucking Negro junkies can't take supply this pure. You know these guys? I don't think anybody I probably can. The younger one's a two-bit horn player by the name of Cornell Tyree. The other one works in distribution. 
started using a little too much of his own product, and Jack D took exception. He wasn't born that ugly. His name's Lamont. Tyrone Lamont. So who's supplying the drugs? That's easy. I have an idea. Whoever knocked off the wharves in San Pedro. Jack Dragna, Mickey Cohen. Dope's been all upside down ever since Jimmy Utley started the long walk at Quentin. You talk about it like That's it's a, lot a of system. Names. It was a system. <laughs> but those days are long gone. It's free for We're all. supposed to uphold the law. Yeah, and we do. But we can't change people. The truth is, everyone wants the license to get a little dirty now and then. Our job is to keep it manageable. That's how you see it? <laughs> see it any other way, and you better forget about being a vice cop. Can we get on with this today, <laughs> preferably? Yes, Carruthers. Let's uh, have a look around the scene here. Ooh, what's this? The wallet? It's got a paper sticking out of it. I bet that's important. Saturday night. Small chance in life is probably better than no chance. Oh, lottery ticket. Got license over here. Let's have a look at that. Tyrone Anthony Lamont. Tyrone Lamont. Not even 23 years old. That is sad. So little life lived. Is that popcorn? I guess let's check out the One body. One is enough to knock you out for combat trauma. Two of them will stop your heart. What was he thinking? I think someone maybe forced the overdose on them? Maybe. That'd be a pretty easy crime to get away with, I feel like. But not with Cole on the case. Mm -mm. We are gonna find out who is responsible for this. Okay, another wallet. Find anything How old was this one? They say only the good die young. I hope it was true in your case. Aww. Clowns lived on popcorn. What's this? JJ always listens. Must have been messy eaters. It's all over the floor. Who is JJ? And why do these two care about his taste in music? Maybe they use the radio I'm station saying, to plan where to make a sale. I don't know. <laughs> Honestly, I am not in the know when it comes to this sort of topic. Uh, more popcorn. There's a black Caesar. Heavy for an empty cup. Oh. That's how they package their product, I wonder. Yeah. They're fix right over the counter in broad daylight. <laughs> Explains all the popcorn everywhere. This place is disgusting. Look at them all. Oh my god. Oh, what we got here? Street have no idea how dangerous this stuff is. Yep. Mm. No cooking or preparation. Must have been the easiest fix these two ever had. Dang, man. Okay, they pretty much just dumped the popcorn out to get what was underneath, I assume. Another special order from the Caesar. I guess we're checking out the Black Caesar. Yeah, that's where it was. Put that down. Oh, music. Oh, what's this? What is this? A cherry's bell win. Some kind of fruit, a bell, and win. Strange doodle. I think it's more than a doodle, probably. I'll have to remember this. I think that'll come in handy. And sheet music. Have a look at that. All in my head. I wonder what's the correlation between love of the needle and love of the music. Another day. <laughs> oh god, imagine this being your bedroom. That sign would drive me crazy. Ugh. Well, they played instruments too. Look at this. Don't Never think there's the any same, importance though. They're everywhere. Another special order from the Caesar. Alright, we probably don't need to pick up every single one of those. We'll be here all fucking night. I guess, yeah, let's check out this body over here. Ooh. Oh, I took his jolt so and drifted off. 
And I suppose his friend wasn't in any condition to notice that he had stopped breathing. The emperor across the street appears to shift a lot of popcorn. Let's shake him down. All right, let's go. Wait, can we talk to Carruthers? No. In a hop head is no way to live, but I can think of worse ways to die. Yeah, I've seen worse ways. At least it probably wasn't too painful. He said just across the way? Oh, arson's the next one. That could be interesting. Which, speaking of, that psychiatrist who prescribes morphine to all of his clients, right. didn't he have somebody burned out of house? Let's before I actually have to work overtime instead of just claim for it. <laughs> You're a true inspiration to us all, Roy. Uh, but yeah, maybe he's... He's gonna be the big fish that we catch at the end of all this. Sorry! Phelps! You should not be letting me drive your car, I will tell you that right now. But, you know, whatever's gonna happen is gonna happen. Oh yeah, Black Caesar. Food hut. 7.38 a.m. Oh, this is cute. Help you? Detectives Phelps and Durrell, LAPD. We're inquiring into the death Hand over the popcorn numbskull before we <laughs> kick the door Calm in. Calm down, Roy. It's not how we do things. Uh, Get that you made him run. Damn it. I like how it's my responsibility to catch him. Stay I'm not the one who's- Oh, he's gonna kick me. He's gonna kick me. Maybe. Maybe not. I appreciate that. <laughs> He's quick. But aren't they all? Oh, look at this rooftop hangout. Aww. Cute colors. Uh, can you just stop running? I'm so sick of them always running. I just have some questions for you, sir. Ugh. Don't mind my partner. He's an asshole. I like the music though on this one. Don't go! Uh, I do it every time! Eddie, help me out, man! They're trying to kill me! You gotta help me out! I'm not trying to kill the nobody! What's going on here? Morgan! <laughs> not you? You picked the wrong cop, you God fucking damn animals! It. Oh, he's good. Got a couple of lucky hits in. That's it, that's all. Just lucky. Oh, fuck. Stop resisting Came in with the old one, too. Dang, man. Just give up already. I just want to question ya. Oh, no, I want to finish. Okay, I guess that, <laughs> that was What's a finish. What's your name? Morgan. Half an answer is no answer to me, asshole. Fleetwood Morgan. Keep an eye on him, Roy, while I take a look around. Yeah. I want to see what you're selling, Morgan. Be very still, Fleetwood. Don't give me an excuse to shoot you. <laughs> Alright, already starting off not liking this partner too much, but I bet you by the end of it, it'll be just like Galloway all over again. Oh, damn, look at that bacon. Burgers. Eggs. Oh, this place is amazing. I would eat here. Eggs. Should we look inside? We obviously just want to find the popcorn containers. Yeah. That's what we're looking for here. Well, oh, there's a popcorn machine. Oh, here we go. Oh, yeah. There oh. it is. There's the evidence we need. Oh, hang on, hang on. There we go. Morphine. Might not be filling, but I'm sure it's satisfying. <laughs> All right, cuff them. That broad got oh, is there more money? Oh no, an instrument. The ticket. The blue room jazz room. By the issuer. Look at that, Chloe. Might get to go check out your crush. Issued by uh, Jermaine Maybe Jones. Can give us something Booking on this agent. Jones character. Let's go ask him. 
All right, Morgan. We're inquiring about the deaths of two men in an apartment across the street, Fleetwood. We want yeah. answers. What say you? Of course. I'll do my best, mister. Of course. This is all I wanted from the beginning. Morphine overdose victims. You yeah. sold the drugs to Cornell Tyree and Tyrone Lamont. Oh, I sell... I, I sell fried steaks and, 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 and black-eyed peas. Yeah, bullshit. Lie. We literally have the evidence. Fleetwood. We know that you supplied them. I found I your supply, buddy. I no drugs. All I do is my ten hair flipping burgers. Can mm -hmm. you prove any different? I honestly think so. <laughs> yeah, morphine for distribution. Flipping burgers yeah. and strapping jolts of morphine to the bottom of popcorn cups, Fleetwood. Now I want the truth. Who supplies the drugs? Cat mm -hmm. by the name of Armstrong Edwards. All right, he brings the stuff around about once a day. I know Armstrong. He's a two-bound, strictly small time. Who's he working for, Fleetwood? Jermaine Jones. Mm, that's the person you got the ticket from. All right, distributor identified. I guess that's where we're heading next. Are we done? Okay, <laughs> let's go. What, you're giving up and going home? Get back here, Cole. Wait, what else Look, am I meant to do? I gave you do? all I got. What do you think? Find his stash. It's in there somewhere. I, I'm pretty sure I already found it. It's right here. <laughs> right? Oh, hang on. Ooh, I didn't realize we could look into the instrument. There's probably something in here. Yeah, I'll look further. Oh. These number slips might affect your tone, Fleetwood. Yeah. May as well check this too. Not everything Even here is going to be there's relevant. There's totally no reason to. All right, I guess we <laughs> have some unfinished business there, Fleetwood. About time we heard what Fleetwood here has to say, Cole. Yeah, agreed. I'm stumped. Ideas? There we go. Numbers slips recovery. We have you for the hop and resisting arrest. Tell us about the numbers if you want our help. Look, the numbers are the white man's tax on poor folk. All right, now, now what else you want to know? Uh, doubt? We have an address on the slips. Yes. We're gonna go down there now and rat you out, Fleetwood. Mm -hmm. Tell whoever it is that you rolled over and gave them up. No, 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 look, I, I've been cooperative, okay? Now you gotta help me some. Fleetwood, I'm wrong. gonna speak personally to the judge on your behalf. A name, Fleetwood. Well, he's, he's a real slick dude. Wears a hat and swings a cane, goes by the name of Merlin, all right? I ain't got a last name. Okay. okay. See you at the station, Fleetwood. Mm -hmm. Pretty sure whatever me, right? they do to him, we were saying that we could do to him. He helped us out. We always like to repay a favor. Can you see that Fleetwood gets a nice cell, Wallace? One with a window and a nice fresh pillow. <laughs> Aw. Well, there's something about Roy that I just do not trust. I don't know. He's got a very fake smile. Oh, we gotta use the phone. Hang on. Isn't that the cop who solved the case and got Yeah, use the phone. I need an address on a Jermaine Jones musical booking agency. Mm -hmm. Just a moment, detective. Jermaine Jones. The office is listed as 5528 Santa Monica Boulevard. Got it. Thanks for your help. Yeah, thank you. I want to go to the jazz club, though. I want to see that sweet singer that pulled his eye in. Now we'll hit up the numbers of operation first. Yeah, let's do that first. I heard you were in the blue room the other night. Mm -hmm. Shouldn't you have been at home? Tucked in bed with the wife and kids? Yeah, Cole. Where I go is your business. It couldn't <laughs> have had anything to do with a certain delightful but damaged German girl, could it? <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about, Roy. I do. All units in the vicinity and any central. I was hot good. Citizen reports of 415 and 7th Central. Unit to handle code Hop one and identify. Your informer. He was my corroborating witness in the Bishop case. Oh, right. Marlon. You're not still sore about that, are you? Actually, I am. Couldn't remember his name, but I remember what happened. He was an accessory happened. to the abuse of the girl. Yeah, they did some sick as fucking long as shit. Hollywood exists, it's going to be chewing up starry eyed little girls. Wrong. Time. You caught the big fish. And look how much good it did in your career. I suppose. I'm glad Cole brought that up because I could not remember the name. 
Okay, I did agree to a side quest, but I realized that our objective is just right here, so we're gonna do that first. Yeah. Let's check this place out. Numbers operation. 8.52 a.m. Doesn't look very in use, does it? Very low-key operation right here. All right, let's go in. Electric hardware supply. Oh. Uh, I hear music. Somebody's in here. Oh, it's a few people. Look at this. Detectives like Phelps and Earl, LAPD. Hey. The name's Marilyn Odie. I run a strictly legitimate bookmaker's detective. Sure. So that's not an sure. illegal wire service that your colleagues are running. And the number slips that I've been picking up all morning with this address <laughs> on them have nothing to do with you. I'll pay my kick to the Watts. And they pay their cut to the LAPD. You can't go shaking me down. You're a loudmouth motherfucker, aren't you? <laughs> Anyone ever tell you the criminals are supposed to keep their mouths shut? Stay where you are while we look around. Roy is such a tough guy. Oh, this guy looks pissed. Oh, there's this cane. Let's have a look around then. Yeah, what's going on with all these phones over here? Cohen took over the wire service from Siegel, right? Am I going to remember these names? Probably not. What do you got over here? Oh, slot machines. <gasps> what was it? Cherry's Bell Win? Yeah, sure, pull the lever. Why not? Cherries? Oh, Cherries Bell. Hold. Oh, okay. This is unlike any slot machine I've ever played. Come on, give me a. Oh, shoot, that was a win. I should have held. That's okay. We'll get it. We'll get it in time. There we go. Hold. And then we just need a win. Keep going. Oh my god. Come on, give me a win. Give me a win. Oh, there we go. We got it. Ooh. Oh. My god. Yep. <laughs> Pretty sure this guy is a supplier, all right. This quantity, we're looking at a high-level trafficking charge. Oh, hang on. What's this? I think Ramez's place is our next stop. Yeah, I think so. Got the tickets? 429, Monday. Thanks for the paper trail, Merlin. <laughs> so he's running an illegal oh, that's lottery. Oh, for a dime, Merlin. You better start talking. Damn it. God, another runner. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Again? Why, he's gonna hit you with the cane coal. Hopefully they bring it with them. He's quick. <laughs> He's a fast one. Oh, where are you going? What's going on in here? Oh, hang on. I fucked up. Oh, I love this diner. I want to come back here. This place looks awesome. I want to eat there. You don't see a lot of cool old school diners. I actually love the look. Yeah, thank you. I see him. Except I won't because I am not holding my gun. Hey, don't mind me. Oh, oh, that! Oh, oh stop it! That's me. Did you see that? Just fucking shove those guys down. Stop shoving people. I will. I ever freaking catch the guy? Come on, come on, come on! Give me a tackle, baby. Watch out! Watch out! Watch out! What are you trying to do, Merlin? Ooh, ooh. Almost. I must be doing something wrong with that because I'm probably holding it too early. Oh my god, this is like the longest chase ever. At least you got some good music to go with it. Got him. <laughs> Thankfully, he stopped. All right, all right, relax, motherfucker. <laughs> you got me. Was it worth it? Nice one, Merlin. Too bad you couldn't pull off your vanishing act. Make your joke, smart guy, but don't damage that. That there's a valuable antique. 
Mm -hmm. You don't say. Maybe you ought to have a look at this, Cole. Something inside of it, maybe? Yeah, inspect further. Oh, it's a little duck. Ooh, what's this? Mr. Jose, Jose Ramos. Ramos Thomas must have found his lucky numbers. The sum of $231 in no sense. IOU? Interesting. Interesting. Anything else in here? No, I guess not. Would you like to calculate the odds on you going to prison for a very long time, Merlin? But I'm, I'm not going level. nowhere. I paid my contributions, and I'm not getting hustled by you. Yeah, about that army surplus morphine. We're only interested in morphine. Army surplus morphine. What do you have to say about that? I heard about that. Big robbery on the ship. Ain't my line of work. I prefer something with a sporting outcome. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Except he had a bunch of it, right? I don't know. I don't know if we have the right... <sighs> morphine for distribution. Except that's what we found at the other place. For whatever reason, the morphine we found here is not one of our clues. I'm gonna go with doubt. Okay, Merlin. <sighs> behave like a Damn moron. It. The two dead guys. I'm telling the <laughs> DA that you sold them the hop. Are yeah. you hearing this? What say you? Loud and Odie. clear, motherfucker. I have chips, and I'm not throwing my cards in this easy. Well, shit. <laughs> Alright, the IOU note from Jose Ramez. Ramez seems to owe you a lot of money. We all owe somebody. Uh, true? Care to elaborate? He has given us a dead stare down. Dead stare. Think you might be being honest? I don't know. Yeah, I'm gonna go with the truth. So it has nothing to do with the proceeds yes. of the morphine Ooh. shipment? Yeah. It's a gambling debt. The heaps took over the wise service and screwed me. Now I just do what I'm told. Run numbers and ship dope. Jose's no different. He just thinks he's a big man that can run up tabs. Alright. You're not the guy we want, Merlin. But we're taking you in. Maybe some time <laughs> in a cell will help you remember something worthwhile. We're expressing everybody. Fuck you. And fuck you. <laughs> You'll never put a charge on me. We'll see about that. Take this bum in. Take the long way around. Don't be gentle with him. You got that? <laughs> yes, sir. Is it weird that I like that guy? The way he delivered that fuck you, fuck you. Ugh. That was good. I like that. Alright, let's go. Uh, ooh, we gotta use the phone again, it appears. Making a lot of calls today. A lot of calls, a lot of arrests. I need an address for Ramez removals. So that's Ramez. R-A-M-E-Z. Oh, right, right, right. Just right. checking. Ramez removals, corner Sunset and Wilton. Owned by a Jose Victor Ramez. Thank you. Excellent, thank you. But we're not going there next. No. Now we're heading on over to Jones's booking agency. Yeah, I want to meet Jermaine. Oh, let's go. Mickey Cole I quite like this car. Mickey does what he's told. Benny <laughs> Siegel will take a cut of any action that's going. I thought Jack dragged them. Dragon is an old-time greaser. He keeps his head down and pays his dues. Word is he's gonna clip Bugsy. Whose word? What does it matter? One lowlife killing another lowlife makes our job easier. I suppose. Sure, yeah, let's do it. It's been a while. Looks like it's way out of the way, though. Oh, look at this little milk truck. <laughs> that is so cute. Oh, there's two of them. This car cost me a fortune, you moron. Sorry, is that another one? And another one. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I kind of watched one. They're so cute. You're paying for every last scratch. I cannot afford to pay for every last scratch. I don't think anybody in this world could. <laughs> but I'm going to cost this car during my duration on vice. Oh, are we here? Finally, this is way out of the way. Oh, what's going on right here? The blue line. Look at this mobster looking guy. Oh, quite the gun. Detective Phelps, I got the call for assistance. Who yep. are the suspects? Bank yep. robbers. Oh. Same gang that took the Citizens National Trust in savings last month. Professionals. Do you say come say hello? 
to my little friend. <laughs> it's okay, we got him. No problem. Holy shit, dude. Oh, look at them all. Just leave the hat alone. Run, run, run! To the truck! Run! Oh, there's one over there. Shit! Got him! Got him! Careful up there, Roy. No! Got him! No problem. Where's this last one? Oh, hop that fence. Oh yeah, looking good. This is like a cute little farm. Look at this. Oh, oh, oh. Don't do it. Don't do it. <laughs> Was he about to try to hit me with his car? That's all of them. Yeah, we got them all. No problem. I like <laughs> that he died and freaking landed on the horn. <laughs> Alright, that was a little bit dark. It was a man's life. Hey, buddy. Have fun. Carruthers is never gonna be out of work as long as I'm on the job. <laughs> Back to the case at hand. Look at me, I'm blending in with the traffic. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, yeah, fuck this. Put it on. We got a we got a lot of distance to cover. We're using the siren. Seriously! I'm using my siren! Get out the way! Uh, idiots. Ooh, sorry buddy. Didn't mean to run over your flowers there. That looked really weird. <laughs> Ooh, there goes the hood. That's gonna leave a mark. No. 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 Jones booking agency. 10.30 a.m. Nice tie, Roy. Kinda like it. Look at this place. I'm guessing not much talent comes out of this talent agency. <laughs> Yeah, we're really working with a lot of rundown buildings over here today. Jones, J. Jones, J. J. Here we are, Jermaine Jones, two thirty-eight. He's the one who listens to that radio station, two thirty-seven FM or something, presumably. Yeah, radio station note. J. J. Always listens to two seventy-five FM. Let's keep that in mind. All right, let's go meet this Jermaine Jones. Hey, oh, you're already in here. Hello. You in? Does it matter? Jermaine Jones, oh, don't bother getting up. Your flunky Fleetwood Morgan just snitched you out. I wasn't planning to. <laughs> now you think you could tell me who the hell you are? LAPD. We'd like to take a look around. The hell you will, motherfucker. You carrying a <laughs> warrant? No, do we need one? Search the place, Cole. Woo! Yeah, what do you never think needed you're a warrant find, before. Police, man? Huh? I don't know. I got a bit of a hunch we might find some freaking morphine. Scott oh, Phantom. Oh, here we go. Fine radio. Short wave AM and FM. My father has a Scott. You yeah. ain't allowed to do we this. Definitely want I got FM. rights. There we go. Oh, I guess we gotta turn the volume on. Turn that on. Two seventy-five. Okay, I was <laughs> I was way off. Two seventy-five then. There we go. Ooh, ooh, hoo, 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 hoo. he's got a little bit of everything in here. Look at this. No wonder this thing is sounding a little muffled, dear man. Mm -hmm. Brennan, Wilt, get over here. Uh oh. Take these assholes uh -oh. apart. Uh oh. Got ourselves another fist fighting boss. coming. Are you guys sure you want to do this? I'm getting That's pretty good at this. Got. Mugs are dope to the eyeballs. 
Yeah. Quick, yeah. Boys, I ain't got time for this. Come on, come on, come on beat these sons of yeah. bitches. Ooh, ooh. Uh, I win. Sit tight, <laughs> asshole. Pretend you're at the yeah, bar you're not going anywhere. your nails done. Cole, you better search through that stuff in the radio <laughs> before you brace our friend here. You got it. How many starving musicians pay with perfect clean 50s? Not many, I assume. Not many. Oh, hang on. We got Ramaz over here, too. Ramaz removals. They must have taken special care delivering this for you. Mm hmm. Precious cargo. Uh, oh, we got some marijuana. Too much for felony possession. I'm thinking intent to supply. I would assume so. I think that's. Basically the plan with everything in this thing. <laughs> yeah, there it is. There's this must stuff. be how those two bums standing guard take their wages. <laughs> and another Odie's ticket. Thursday. Your friend Fleetwood was also a betting man, Jermaine. Yeah, he was. We already talked to that guy, though. Was that everything? I think that's everything. Yeah, I think we're good. Anything else in this office before we question the guy? Okay, I'm not intentionally trying to trash your place. How'd that hurt, guys? Hmm? You feeling that? You're gonna be feeling much worse tomorrow. Oh my god! Cole, what are you doing? You don't need to freaking throw trash everywhere. Dang, okay, I don't think we need to find anything else in here. Let's just talk to the guy. Oh, hang on. Anything over here? What's this, cigars? Optimistic, Cole. Yeah, it's nothing. Another radio. Oh, another Rama's. I hope what are you doing? What stuff is purloined, Mr. Jones. <laughs> I have a receipt for that thing. Somewhere. I'm sure. I'm sure. <laughs> that was strange. <laughs> All right, let's talk to this guy then. Lamont and Tyree are dead. At a stretch, the DA could have you on felony murder for supplying stolen government money. Tyrone and Cornell are dead. Mm -hmm. hmm. They're on a slab downtown with the ME examining their last meal. Popcorn washed down with morphine. You offering me a deal. I have a pet judge who hates blacks. He'll give you 50 years for your two buddies. Another 30 for stealing from Uncle Sam. You'll be out by the time you're 110. Imagine the changes you'll see. I get the message. How much is this gonna cost me? Just some information, I think. <laughs> yeah, about the army surplus morphine. Who supplies the morphine? Yeah. I don't know nothing about that. He definitely knows something. He's get he knows where he's getting it from. He's looking down. I think he wants to tell us, but he also really doesn't want to tell us. Doubt. So we make you for yes. all of it. You're the fall guy from Mickey Cohen. You don't want to be the fall in guy, man. In case you haven't noticed, I'm a colored man. You see any Jew boys running around here? I collect my cut. Lenny the Fink controls the action. Lenny who? Lenny Finkelstein. Mickey's dipshit brother-in-law. <laughs> Interesting. Lenny Finkelstein. All right, link to Ramez. Uh, What's removals. the score with Ramez removals? I brought a radio from there. That's all. Uh, yeah, I doubt that. He's looking down. I don't think we have any evidence. About his knowledge of Ramez. I kind of think he's being honest. I don't know, he's looking down. He is looking smug. Wait, he's lying. <laughs> what are you doing with your eyes, man? He looks sneaky. Very deepers delighty. I don't know. I don't know. Like, I want to call him on a lie, but I don't know what evidence I would use. <sighs> Doubt. So when we visit oh, yes. And tell them that we want a special bookcase or wardrobe to hide our dope in. They're going to be copacetic. <laughs> and when Seems we tell them their good friend Jermaine sent us and said they could do a nice deal for the LAPD. I could use an act like you two. <laughs> Those fucks Thank Abbott you. and Costello are on the slide. Hollywood could use another couple of deeply unfunny white bread humps like you. Very oh, good, really? Jermaine. 
You have character. Now cough it up. Ramez is a good friend of Lenny the Fink. You're getting the picture? All right, what do you know about the involvement of Odie? Where's the link between the morphine and the numbers slips? There Ooh. is no link. You're wasting your time here. What? <laughs> what was that face? This guy's expressions are amazing. Hmm. I'm guessing uh, a lie. Distributor identified. Found with number slips and morphine. Morgan names Jones as distributor. I feel like that's the connection. That's the proof, right? Oh, these illegal gambling operation numbers. IOU notes. Yeah, I'm gonna go with lie. You're lying to me, Jones. Mm -hmm. Tell me about Merlin. Who? I don't know anyone named Merlin. Oh, yes, I do believe you do, sir. I hope this is right. I don't know. I always second guess when I call someone on lies. Fleetwood oh, yes. will testify that you and Merlin mm -hmm. are expanding out of illegal gambling and into drugs. Uh huh. Okay. So I buy from a cat <laughs> goes by the name of Merlin Adi. Merlin runs the lottery for the two boy. The Fink has a new line in drugs. You screen me out, Adi, and I ever tell him. Tell us about Adi. Hardy's a gambler. Fronts points on football games, fights, the horses, numbers, chicken crossing. That's what he the said. Road. Motherfucker will take the odds on anything. <laughs> take them all in. We have a deal, right? <laughs> We're after the morphine. I'll speak to the DA on your behalf. You have my word. Dang, we really are arresting everybody today. Also, I feel like that information would have been useful when we were questioning Obi. <laughs> oh well. Oh well. Uh, I guess let's check out Ramez's place. So Mickey Cohen or Jack Dragon has stole the army surplus morphine, and they are selling it on the streets? Looks that way. But the mob so wants return customers, not corpses. Why haven't they cut the morphine? Good question, detective. Mm -hmm. This robbery happened months ago, right? The beginning of the year. So why are the proceeds suddenly turning up now? Another good question. But where are you it hoping get we'd us? forget about it? <laughs> it's like asking questions in the middle of the movie. If you just sit tight and keep your yap shut, you'll find out what happens. This place we is way to too fucking busy. Evidence. We are. That's what I do, man. That's my specialty. Sure, we'll do one more. We'll do one more. On it. So it sounds like Finkelstein's the guy we want. He's the uh, head honcho of this whole operation. Some sort of Jewish mob boss? Is that what's happening here? I don't know. I guess we'll find out. Ooh, ooh. That's not good. What have we got? got a hostage. Commies. Three guys tried to knock the place over and got jumped. Now they got a half dozen patrons and staff for insurance. Do we know the Shit. situation inside? Two inside covering the hostages, plus this charmer at the front door. Mm. We need to do something about him now, sir. He won't negotiate, and he'll kill this poor bastard if we don't put him down. Well, shit. You come any closer, I'll pull the trigger. Ah! Save the hostages. Ah! Run, people, run. Oh, Got him. Did anybody get killed? I th don't think so. I think we did that pretty cleanly. I don't know, that was me. <laughs> I'm sure there was at least one bad casualty. But it wasn't me, so. Code 4 at Hollywood First National Bank, corner of Hollywood and Highland. Suspects are down. I need an ambulance and notify the coroner. Roger on the ambulance, 11K. All units be advised, suspects are down at Hollywood First National. So we're always just car 11? Oh, we unlocked a new outfit? Ooh, Hawkshaw outfit. Yeah, we will save that for tomorrow. It's exciting. It's been a while since we got some new clues. Alright, <laughs> Ram has his removal spin. Let's get to the bottom of this whole morphine racket. Holy crap, there are so many side quests today. No, I'm done. And here it is. Ramez removals, 11.31 a.m. Oh, look at all those trucks. Dang. Is that him? LAPD. Hi. We're here to see Jose Ramez. What's it about? Routine inquiries, sir. Can you tell us where we can find him? You missed him. That's him right there. He was in the delivery truck. Just went out. God damn it. <laughs> he 
Did that on purpose. Let's, let's go. Calling KGPL. Go ahead, 11K. 11K requesting assistance in pursuit of narcotic suspects aboard a GM delivery truck. Commercial license, David Charles, 457. I don't know if we're going to be able to take this thing out. It's pretty big. Hit it! Clear this asshole Oh! 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 What is this lunatic? Oh! <laughs> what? We're not Careful, these things are probably here. full take of morphine. The road. Here comes the cavalry. Oh, excellent. So we got some backup, baby. Keep it steady and I'll try oh. to bust his tires. <gasps> Getting oh, close. Sh oh, 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 really? Oh, are you oh, fucking oh, kidding oh, me? Oh my god. Uh, that was infuriating. <laughs> it's fine, then we got this. Oh my god! That's it, Lord. You did it. It's truck's history. That worked? <laughs> nice. Totally intentional. Did all that on purpose. Come on, buddy. Out of the truck. You've been had. Put your hands in the air! I like your shirt. Pretty nice shirt. Jose Ramez, you're being arrested on suspicion of supplying illegal mm -hmm. drugs, resisting arrest, and for malicious damage to LAPD property. Hey, yeah, that's pretty messed hold up, your man. horses. I supply furniture, not drugs. And that thing back there, that was an accident. <laughs> not fair, this guy. Some furniture came loose. That's all. Save it for the DA, Chico. Keep an eye on him. We're gonna take a look around inside. Yeah, you wait here. That is a lot of stuff. A lot of stuff. My god, I can't look through all of this. I am only one man. I got an accomplishment. Oh, newspaper. It's been a while and I feel like these are more relevant than ever now that we're on Vice. Yeah. Give it a read. Mickey Cohen. Heir apparent to Bugsy Siegel. Oh. Courtney. What if the creepy psychiatrist is gonna be in this one? Oh, ooh. Ooh, what's going on here? That is a lot of men. Oh, this guy looks important. Is that Finkelstein? Can you think anywhere else to meet, kid? We like to choose Finkel, our ground. Whatever his name was. What is that supposed to mean? Huh? It's something Wellington said at Waterloo. The guys who win normally choose where to fight. We're we gonna fight, kid. The two of you versus my boys here. Mm -hmm. I love the fight game. I went a few rounds myself. You and your friend. Uh, it looks tough, but uh, I don't like your chances. Nah. We don't have to fight, Mr. Cohen. We have you an infilate. What the fuck Ooh. is that? Some kind of steak? <laughs> it means my men are in cover, but that they can still shoot you. Oh. If those were my orders, you would all be dead now. Are you kidding me? This is a $200 coat. You got some balls. Kelso. I hope you didn't scratch the paint of my new Lincoln. Mm -mm. These guys are getting out of the dope business, Mr. Cohen. You'll have no more problems from them. The morphine is going to disappear back into the sea. Hang on. You're getting hasty. There's a lot of dough on offer here. Thanks for the offer, Mr. Cohen, but we are going to have to politely decline. After today, the morphine is no more. This isn't the way we normally do business. I'm aware of that, Mr. Cohen. Call me Mickey. Are you aware of the risk, huh? I'm giving it to you straight, Mr. Cohen. There will be no more morphine. We made a mistake and would like to back out gracefully. If you come after us, we will be forced to come after you. You've been polite up till now. So don't stop making threats. I don't make threats, Mr. Cohen. <laughs> that makes promises. I'd like to thank you for your time. Is that guy your idea, muscle kid? <laughs> There's something you should know about Jack, Mr. Cohen. He killed six Japs hand to hand with just a bayonet and a K-bar knife. His outfit, Impressive. the six Marines, killed over 100,000 Japs in three months in Okinawa, and he was in the thick of it. Those Japs are little guys, right? Yes, Mr. Cohen. About your size. <laughs> oh! <laughs> He's impressed with that one. That's pretty ballsy. Yeah, get out of here. 
Still not 100% sure what's going on here. Cries innocence as police begin inquiry. A little bit more curious about everything going on with the whole Mickey Cohen thing. A little bit curious about this whole all of it thing. What's with the puddle? Oh, puddle. Where's that trail of water coming from, oh, Cole? Oh, oh. Hopefully towards the evidence we need. Oh, okay, it's going this way. All right, over here. There must be a way through the back. Why is it so wet? This is weird. Welcome to Furniture Village, where Holy taste crap. comes to die. <laughs> Good one, man. What a pile of junk. My mother would be in heaven. <laughs> I bet this is the kind of crap you love, Cole. Holy crap, man. Do you ever stop? Fashion. Really? Really? That's just uncalled for. And there's some nice stuff here. I'll oh, have you know. <laughs> this is pretty cool. I'd put that up in my house. Ooh, I'm also like in this chair. It's pretty neat. This couch though. Ooh. Oh, this this seat though? Look at that lounger. Oh. Yeah, I would also have that in my house. This is useless. Okay, there is stuff here I like. I can't I admit see it. a damn thing. Ooh, what is going on? You need to get right up here? onto the floor above. The floor above. Okay, I saw a ladder. Didn't I? Oh, is there something through this door right here? No. Apparently there is not. Or above. Oh, right freaking here. The Going up. Going way up. Holy shit. Oh, I feel a clue over here. Oh. Not a fan of it up here. Oh, what's this? Oh, are you kidding me? What do I have to do? Light indicates crane position. Oh, this is weird. <laughs> I like it. Oh, we want to get to that door right there that's blocked. Is that what we're doing? I see it. Yeah, I think that's a door. Yeah, that's where the water went by the looks of it. This might take me a minute. We'll just put everything over here. <laughs> Can we stack them? Nope. All right, clearly I put too much shit up here already. Can we put it right here? Why, well, yes. Okay. Get this one, and that should be good, yeah? Damn, watch it out, Roy. There's a cold room in the back. Yep. On my way. Oh, hang on. What's in here? Oh, it goes outside. Okay, I don't imagine there's anything out here. Let's go down. I think we know where the water's coming from. Yeah, You're gonna something's see this. thawed in there. Oh, is it bodies? Is it bodies? Oh no. Oh, this is why they took them a while to start selling it after they stole it. They froze it all. Oh. I get you. Damn, that's a lot. That's a lot of morphine. That explains why there's water everywhere too, since they had to thaw it all out. Oh yeah, I guess we'll look at this one. Clever, clever. There's something frozen inside. You know what it is, Cole. Uh, what are we doing? Why do we have a gun? Are we gonna shoot them out? Oh! <laughs> Very clever. Explains why they're all cracked. Uh, now what? Oh, there we go. Well, I'll be damned. Oof. Yeah, let's have another look at another one of these things. I don't even need to freaking get a close look at the front. I already know what it's going to say. Yeah. Pretty clever. It's like Santa's grotto for hop heads in here. Ice. <laughs> that's clever. Yeah, it is. Better than popcorn cup, that's for sure. <laughs> look at it all. It's a big boy. It's not big small. Best. Pretty good first case now on mice, if I do say so myself. Finkle, right? Yeah, Finkelstein. Oh, is there someone over here too? Oh, what's this? Rama's removals. Oh, his ledger. Where's he been delivering? Some information and who's in been here. delivering here? Any repeat business in the ledger, Cole? Oh wait, yeah, we probably want to see who's delivering too. Deliveries received. Delivery sent. Okay, let's check out the receives. 
feel like that's gonna be... Yeah, there you go! 2 by 40 gallon block, Polar Bear Ice Company. Polar Bear Ice Company. Polar Bear Ice Company. I bet that's it. Hmm. I think we know why Ramez has been ordering so much ice. Okay, we do know that. Is that the right clue? Was that it? <laughs> I guess we go question them next. Yeah, Polar Bear Ice. Oh! What perfect timing. Are you guys not worried about the police officers right there? LAPD, <laughs> leave it right there! Everyone out of the vehicle the and put your hands up! Down. There's something in the ice. What? Make a run for it! Oh! Oh! Just fucking shot a cop! Oh, big mistake, buddy! Right in the ass. Did we kill him? <laughs> I, did, I didn't want to, but I had to, I think. I'm sorry, but at least we knew it was... he was guilty. Okay. Take them all to Hollywood Idiot. Station. Have the ME and tech services go over this place. Where will you be? Hunting polar bear. <laughs> Zing. Search polar bear ice co. Alright, let's go. I guess the truck just fucking left. Is Audi serious? Is oh, why does this weird? Blind eye to narcotics? Doesn't surprise Keep me to be honest with you. Helps. Drugs are prohibited. Doesn't Everyone mean has people price. don't want to take them. Limiting supply Everyone. doesn't mean that we have limited demand. Oh, you bitch! <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I understand that. I know that the average Joe needs to unwind. Let his hair down again. Morphine? Heroin? It's important to demonize hop felt. What the hell are these streets? But when all is said and done, it's just another chemical like booze. A lot of people in high places think we're doing the city a favor by keeping the dope rolling into Central Avenue. Donnelly certainly believes we need to keep them anesthetized. Better jobs and opportunities would go a lot further. Yeah. Oh, what's here? What, what is this? What is this? Against the odds? What? <laughs> who's, who's this guy? Detective Phelps. Look, Phelps, in a minute a bag man named Rampley's gonna walk in here and put a mint on some horse running in the fifth. We don't care about Rampley so much as we want his boss. He's the one we're gonna put away for fixing the race. You're hoping Rampley will lead us to him? Bingo. Here's what you're gonna do. Get in there. Blend in. Wait for our mark. He'll be in a dark coat. Wait until he hands over the cash. Then tail him. Good luck. I will try my best. Did not know what I was signing up for. Did not realize this was going to be a stealth mission. I'll wait outside. Keep an eye on the place. Sure. Long black coat. There's the guy. I heard he's an honest cop. There's an oxymoron for you. See him? Let's go incognito. Yeah. Stuck your face uh, in that paper that hole. I should have listened better. I already forgot half of what he said. Just remember the black coat, which this is probably the guy right here. Give me a grand that cavalcade in the fifth. Tail the suspects. Okay. Should I get in the car? I'm very happy, very relieved that he's marked on the mini map. Basically, just don't sprint, and we all probably be fine. Shit, where'd he go? Did you just go down the alley? I looked away for like two seconds. Hey, come on! This ain't New York! Shit! <laughs> okay, he saw us. You playing hide and seek, Mac? Maybe. 
Thank you for your assistance. Ooh, ooh, did we do it? Finally. <laughs> that was surprisingly difficult for me. I'm not good at stealth. Got it, boss. A full G. She's coming in at 20 to 1. You and I are about to retire. LAPD, you're both under arrest. <laughs> of course. Some dude. Oh! Oh, you, you bitch! You bitch! I was not prepared for that. Damn, Cole went full ragdoll. Hopefully that was a checkpoint, because I don't really want to do that stealth a bit again. But I already know I'm going to have to. Whatever. Whatever. Is God serious? damn it. Is the auto, hey, what are you, the fourth stooge? Can hear this guy? Let's skip. God damn these assholes. <laughs> Not my cleanest. Oh, who's shooting? Who else was shooting? Did Roy come in and help? I don't know. Yeah, this is 11K. K calling KGPL. Ambulance required at Got sunset more bodies. Ivar. Shots fired. To the polar bear ice place. Polar ice, whatever it was called. We're hunting some polar bears. <laughs> Lame, I know, but you know, I heard it from the best. Oh, this is it, polar bear. Oh, sorry, sorry. I was looking at the idiot. sign. You're not wrong there, Roy. Polar Bear Ice Company. 1239 p.m. Oh. It's been three years. Who's not this guy? Not much call for ice anymore with all those newfangled refrigerators. Save it for someone who wants <laughs> to hear it. How many janitors carry a gat? Ooh. That's one way of announcing wow. we're here. I am impressed, Roy. Very nice. Give it up, Finkelstein. Your brother-in-law will get you a good lawyer. My brother-in-law okay, hates my guts. Come and get me if you want some daylight through the suit of yours. Oh, on it. Now show your face. Show your face. It's around here somewhere. We'll find it. Throw them. out the guns. Come get me. Oh, I'm going to come get you. You're mine. Oh, damn, there's another one back there? Where did Finkelstein go? Find some cover. He's just running. How many men does he have? Okay, we need to wait a second. Um, how to die it over here? Oh my God, Roya! You're winning me over too. Oh, I'll take some more. Stay down. There's so many more. Oops. Thanks, man. That was freaking nice. Did we climb over it? No. Oh, 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 oh. Oh god, oh god. Give us some goddamn cover. Working on it. Down and your hands in the air. Let's go. Oh, careful. Careful. Dead Finkelstein, leave the weapon yeah, and put your hands up now. Put my hands up. Sure. Then what? Cop to peddling the dope, cut a deal, ship me off to the queue. As soon as I get locked up, some old friend puts a, an ice pick above my ear. No thanks. Only one mm -hmm. other way out, shit heel. So it comes. Oh god, damn it! Well, I knew that was gonna happen, but I was still unprepared. Fuck. Let's have a look around. Now that we finally got some peace and quiet. <laughs> yeah, just walk over the body, guys. I think I've had enough ice for one day. Until the scotch I pour myself as soon as we... Ooh, look at it all. 2,000 in each This stuff box. has got to be worth at least 100 grand. So Finkelstein robbed the ship? My guess is Lenny took it off their hands. This is big. Oh, this is going to make yeah. the papers, Phelps. 
That actually explains what was in the paper we saw today. Talking. Sounds good. Because I don't even know what I would say. <laughs> oh my god. This is unfathomable amounts well, well, of morphine. Who would have thought that Earl's handpicked new partner would have turned out to be such a great case man? Yeah. This is a good result, <laughs> Phelps. As far Thanks. as we can tell, Lenny the Fink was moving the morphine across the city and as far north as Frisco. This makes the feds very happy and it makes Mickey Cohen look bad. I won't lie to you, I'm kid. Me. I like the headlines. I <laughs> like them a lot. You keep Thanks, this boss. squad in the papers and we'll get along just fine. You got it, sir. Aww. Okay, yeah, I like Roy right off the bat. He's pretty cool. I didn't like him when we first met him, and then the second encounter we had with him. Hated him, but it's pretty cool. He, he requested me personally to be his partner. Oh, he fucked up one question. Oh, we missed a clue too. Dang. Oh, well. Three star. The death of Lenny Finkelstein should keep administrative advice in the headlines. For now. <laughs> That was good. I definitely am already enjoying our first day on Vice. Honestly, the case felt like one of the easiest ones yet. Even though I missed a clue and a question, that's fine. There was really no no question who was guilty in this case at all. I feel a little bit bad for all the guys we arrested along the way, but at the end of the day, they were selling very deadly drugs that was clearly very easy to overdose on. Sound familiar? Same shit still happening to this day. I kind of miss Homicide, I'm not gonna lie to you. I kind of miss Rusty, my good old pal Finbar, and even miss Donnelly a little bit. But I think I'm gonna fit in just fine with this, with this division. <laughs> of course, uh, thank you so much for joining me for this one, and let me know in the comments below what you thought of it, and I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, give it a like. If you want to join me for my next Vice case, subscribe. And I hope to see you in the next one. Bye.